Hey, how you doing? This is Kitch, and you are watching me play RimWorld. We have an item stash opportunity. We can get a psychic emanator. Um... Ah, 426 silver. Um, the Psychic Emanator, I think, gives everybody in that range a permanent mood boost, and I think that is something that I would definitely like. Um, 426 silver. Oh, we don't have a trade beacon. Uh, postpone. Um... Trade beacon, trade beacon. Uh, that's this. We need that. Uh, we need uh, Ray to prioritize doing research. And that is your number one thing to do, correct? It is, so you should get on that as soon as you wake up. Um, let's see, 19 hours, 18 days. Ah, uh, yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna be able to get it. But uh, boy, that would have been nice. That would have been really nice. Amy, what were you doing out there? Are you cleaning dirt? Oh, we're probably expanding our home area again, aren't we? Um, luckily, once we get all this wall and stuff built... Oh, we do have a raid. Group of pirates. Okay, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 of them. So that means we need to kill 6. And they have some pretty heavy firepower. And only one with a melee weapon. All right. Um, I think it said they were going to prepare for a while. I hope they're going to prepare for a while. This uh, this should be a fun fight. I'm sure it'll be fine though. We have um, we have two guns. Um, they have a lot more, and. Let's see. I guess we can hope that the traps will take care of them. Anyway, let's get everybody uh, woken up there. And maybe right here for now, just to make sure they're all going to the south. It looks like they are. Um, this could be bad. Um, this could be very, very bad. Uh, let's see. Ray, why don't you go... Uh, you guys stay right there. Sarah, you stay in the back. This is actually just fine. All right. Raven is going to go with the direct approach, and um, that is great. Got one of them with the traps. Okay, you're going over there, so Sarah, can you intercept him? And you guys, let's focus on firing at these guys. Well, that, that, that won't work. Sarah, pull back. Okay, he's coming through here. Okay, Sarah, keep going. Oh, that hurt. That hurt real bad. All right, that did it. They are now fleeing. I don't know why they're fleeing. Oh, I guess some of them went through the traps. Well, that's fine. Let's see, I think they're actually gonna cause some problems. Um, where are you going? You're beating out the fire? How are you doing health-wise? You got hit quite a lot. No, why don't you not do that? Why don't you go instead to the, this medical bed? And rest there. Uh, Dez, why don't you take care of the fire? And Nelson, you just chase these guys down. And Ray, you, you can help too. Because they are going to want to... Well, the, the traps will get them as well. It'll be fine. Alright, let's see. Is anybody hurt? No, it looks like... Looks like they all died. And that is just fine. Uh, Nelson, actually, why don't you come over here? I would like you to take care of Sarah, because she is not in great shape. 
Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, nine up here. Or at least just eight. And we've only got four graves, so let us make some more. Let's just make the whole line. Great. And that gave us a pretty good assault rifle. I'm pretty happy about that. Um, Nelson, let's see. Are you taking care of Ray? Why don't you take care of Ray? Oh, or not Ray, Sarah. Did I get that right? Yeah, you are taking care of Sarah. Ray, what are you doing? You're researching again. Why don't you take care of this guy? He is going to beat down her door, beat on her door here, and I want his stuff. Des, come up here and help. Uh, we got a couple of normal assault rifles, which is excellent. We got a poor sniper rifle, which isn't great. And we got a good sniper rifle and a normal... Um, Machine pistol, which uh, I will take any day of the week. Um, Des, why don't you come take care of this? Um, Des and Ray, can you guys work together to take care of that guy? And um, okay, we got him. We got him. And how are you? You're good at cooking. You're really great at melee. And you have a good, yeah. And we do have a bed. Yes, we do. So why don't you go ahead and capture him? And Ray, we will release you. And while we're thinking about it, get a granite door. No, we have to do a slate door right there to replace that. And um, OK, Sarah's getting treated. Everybody else should be OK. Wonderful. Um, OK, so accuracy. At medium range is about 75%. Uh, damage per second. Where's the damage? Seven. Warm up of nine seconds. Three shots. Whereas the bolt action rifle has a much higher accuracy, much higher damage, but a lot bigger time there. So uh, what about this? What is this uh, machine pistol like? Six damage, three shots, horrible accuracy. Good accuracy, yep, close. Let's see, who was our other shooter? It was um, Ray, right? Yeah, you have that. Why don't you exchange that out for one of these assault rifles? Where are you currently located? You are there. Let's see, we have a normal one. And what was yours? Yours was good. So yeah, why don't you grab that? And, uh, okay, Des, you did good there. Why don't you haul that wood so that door will close? Great. All right, so, yeah, I don't think that's going to work for our item stash opportunity. But, um, Nelson, what are you doing now? You are tending to that prisoner. Great. Um, didn't we set up a stockpile down here? No, I guess we didn't. I would like to. Let's uh, do that. Uh, zone stockpile right here. We want um, to clear everything but medicine. And we do not want medicine in this stockpile. And that will get all that stuff moved out. And it'll keep our medicine a little bit closer to where it is needed. And that really doesn't need to be a medical bed. Um, if I take that out, you should make it there eventually, right? Yeah, there goes our item stash opportunity. We are not going to get the psychic emulator or whatever it was done at least now. Cargo pods. Got some plasteel. That is wonderful. And um, the snow is going away. It is 28 degrees outside. It is hot. It is extremely hot out there. Great. That means, uh, that means we survived the winter. 
that is uh, fairly good, I believe. Um, let's see, that also means we might want to get this guy turned back on. And we'll watch the temperatures. What we may want to do is open up this uh, grow area here. Except for where the batteries are. Maybe expand this out so we can actually grow some more stuff. Are you guys... Um, actually, I think I want everybody kind of on a high priority for hauling right now. Just to get some of this stuff covered. Because it is some good stuff. See, so, yeah, why don't you grab that. And Emmy, why don't you grab that. And Emmy, you can... Well, that's poor. We don't really care about that one. Why don't you haul that? And, um, yeah, not, not, not really concerned about those. Do we have this one? Yeah, we want this one. And, uh, just one more. We want to grab this revolver. We don't quite want to lose it yet. Sarah's up. Nobody's going to feed her, so she's... No, nope, actually, she's going to go feed some other folks. Nelson, I don't think you got treated. Oh, no, you did. So you're fine. Oh, there goes all... Wow, that just kind of instantly... Instantly goes? Is that is that what I'm reading there? Okay. Um. Well, let's um flick that on. I guess we didn't flick it on. We forgot to flick it on. Oh, well. I, I mean, it's it's fine. It's fine. We lost a lot of meat, but I'm sure it will be fine. It's springtime now. Uh, there's going to be animals and stuff coming through, so I think I'm not concerned about losing that meat. I would have rather have not lost the meat. Don't don't get me wrong, but I'm not concerned that it is gone. Okay, Nelson is our uh, yeah. Nelson is up and about. Let's see, I would like him to prioritize working on these graves. Let's see, I'd like you to do that. No, I would like you to do that, and then that, and then that, and then that, and then that. What are you doing now, repairing the marble wall? No, finish doing what I told you to do. There we go. Now we can get some of those bodies taken care of. Oh, there we go. Um, what's happening here? Who are you hunting? You're hunting Ray. Where is Ray? Ray is way up there. Hmm. Can we intersect or intercept him somehow? Who do we have? We have Dez here. Uh, Dez, you come here. Ray, stop what you're doing and come over here. And you guys can take care of that. And I'm not sure. I guess I told you to grab the gun rather than haul it. Is that what happened? Uh, you're not terrible at shooting, but you are much better at melee. Speaking of melee, why aren't you meleeing? There we go. All right. Uh, Des, uh, why don't you come down here in this stockpile? Uh, Ray, you're as you were. Des, drop your gun. And don't drop forbidden. And come up here and grab the knife. Uh, let's see. You want to grab all of these. Just set them all to auto rearm. Oh, that silver in the way is not going to help with that. Auto rearm. Auto rearm. Des, okay, you're good. Actually, bury him while you're up here. Okay, let's make sure all of these are set to auto arm and um, just yeah, rearm while we're here. Uh, auto rearm and rearm. There we go. Now we shouldn't have to worry about that anymore. And let's see. Let's hope he will die soon. No, he will not. Um, Nelson, what are you doing? You're eating a meal. Why don't you come and just take care of this dog real quick? Oh, 
he's seeking his revenge. Why are you not? There we go. And a zit, another one? Looks like we just had one of those. Um, let's see, Nelson and Ray. Ray's you're on the way over there. Nelson, you can go over there too. Right, and let's check the power connections. They are fine. You know, it seemed like it used to make the the conduit go away, the, the power conduit go away. I wonder if that was a change in the beta 18 version. I like it. it, it it's nice. Uh, those zit events are annoying enough without... Sarah, you're resting up. Uh, Ray, you did get a little bit of a bite, but you got tended. Um, we have this corpse out here that is rotting, so I would like you to take care of that. And what do you have there? An egg? Great. Yeah, cook that egg. Let's see, do they... Okay, it's still 30 out there. Huh, I guess it's the heat coming in from here that was causing that to actually um, heat up, causing the freezer to heat up. That's interesting. That's something to, to think about and consider is that the heat from this room, 629 and 69, hmm. I guess that's another argument for the double walls. I mean, it, it, it's not that big of a deal because we, we just turned this. I just turned this off. I don't even know why. It just seemed wasteful. But in reality, it would have been fine. It would have been just fine. Uh, we have plenty of electricity. We would not have felt it. All right. We are getting a little low on the meat, though. And uh, we got a nice herd of caribou here. And a nice herd of elk. Uh, maybe we want to go and take some of those guys out. Uh, try out some of our new shiny weapons that we just got from that raid. Hmm. Let's see. Nelson, you've got a shooting skill of 11. And Ray, you're other shooter. Right? Your skill is 6. Huh. Oh, well, we will set you to chat and recruit now that I'm thinking about it, because you do have a... No, you are a melee guy. All right, well, if we recruit you, we can get um, Dez back onto a gun. Oh, and wow, what a quick recruitment. Excellent. Very excellent. Um, so, yeah, we were going to... What were we going to do with you? We were going to give you a melee weapon, right? Um, let's see, Dez, do you have... You have a knife, and you have that. What is your melee skill at? Okay, you're just meleeing to melee. You've actually got a pretty good melee skill, though, so we might leave you there. Hmm. You have got an absolute excellent melee skill, though. I think what I'm going to do is... Sarah, you come up here. And, yeah, you go there... Sarah, you go ahead and drop that and grab, let's see, what do we have here? Got a steel club? Great. Yeah, you grab that steel club and you grab that Iqua. And I think that will work out better for everybody. All right, how's our expansion coming along? It looks very good. Looks really good. See, that is not a wooden door. No, it is a sandstone door, and that is fine. How are we doing on the sandstone blocks? We are running really low. Um, let's just copy you as a start, and let's see. We don't want you growing. We don't want you doing any of that stuff. Did we just get you for your melee? Is that what it was? No, you have excellent research as well. You are by far our best researcher. Um, and you're not a bad cook either, so you can be a backup cook. And do hauling and cleaning as a higher priority. Not Des, though. Um, there we go. Alright, that was our inspiration. That was our new 
and we have a Bennett camp opportunity. I have a feeling that we're not going to want to do this because it looks like it is just a bajillion miles away. Just out of curiosity. Two days? Two days to go that far, huh? Hmm. Okay. Um, I'm still not going to do it. I'm just, I'm just surprised that that distance can be covered in two days. I don't have any reason to believe the game would fib to me, so... Uh, one thing I do not like is this open door here, so why don't you grab that. There we go. Okay, Akio is fully healed. Akio? That's what I, that's what I'm gonna call him. Yeah, I guess, I mean, we don't, we've got a lot of um, potatoes and, and things like that out here. We don't have, um, I guess, if, if we want to keep doing the good meals, uh, we are going to have to do a bit of hunting. Which uh, shouldn't be too bad. Um, it should be just fine. And we still have some weapons out here, too. And some wart. Um, yeah. I don't feel like researching brewing in order to take advantage of that. That's That's basically why I just let that sit out there. Um, anything else going on on the map? Um, let's see, there's some ship chunks here. Um, there's a fox here that died of natural causes, I assume? Um, yeah, well, if you're out there, just uh, go ahead and grab that fox. Um, let's see, the plasteel's still out there. And there's a million blocks out here and wood and stuff that needs to be hauled. What is this? You're another fox. And uh oh okay, Emmy and Aki okay, the two new the two new folks got together. Great. Um yeah, eventually I'm gonna open this up, but I don't wanna do that quite yet. Um now that this wall is not completely filled in. And I don't really know what we're gonna do over here with all this space. Um I'm not really sure. But we'll find something, I'm sure. Stockpiles, if nothing else. We need bedrooms and stockpiles um, is really what we need. Maybe a little better recreational room. Ooh, a ton of steel. That is excellent. Um, how is everybody's hauling? We may just bump that down again so that everybody will just go and grab something. If you haven't already. Um, how are these blocks up here? Not great. Oh, well, they're, they're, they're filling in. People are grabbing them. That is good. And, um, let's see. It's up to 27 outside, which is nice. Um, nobody is researching. Oh, that's because I told you guys to haul and clean. Um... Let's see, you are our highest by far, so I'll go ahead and bump those up for you so you can get to working on that. And we are out of meat. We are definitely out of meat. Got a tiny little herd up here. I guess all those caribou moved on. Probably should have got them while we had the chance. Some down here. Uh, who knows? Hopefully some more will show up soon. Looks like uh, the haulers are going out to get the more distant stuff. Boy, that steel is as far away as steel can be. Oh, that was the ship parts we deconstructed, right? Yeah, I think so. So close. Just two more. Just two more to go. All right. Well, speaking of meat, here comes some right now. Um, oh, and you went in that little area. How convenient. 
Let's see, yeah, why don't you two come on and uh, Akio, let's get some practice in for you as well. Did that get his attention? It looks like it did. Uh, Des and Ray, are you guys going to come? Oh, you guys were way out there. So, um, yeah, hopefully this... Uh, let's just wait. Oh, it's just an Ibex. How bad could it be? This guy's got great melee skill. He's got a decent weapon. Okay, and here comes Ray to help. A little late, but here comes Ray to help. And Des, we don't need you anymore. Are you going to haul that? Yes, you are. Great. Okay, I would like to fast forward now. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I, 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 there's some kind of option that says you can pause when certain events happen. I remember seeing that, and I think that may be tied to that. Uh, that's my theory, at least. Maybe it's not. Maybe that's something completely different. I mean, it would be fine if, if whenever a raid or something came, or, or something like a mad animal, if you just paused it, that would be great. I, I would love that. I think that, that would be excellent. But this whole not allowing you to fast forward thing for seconds, I mean, it's really not that big of a deal, except it, it really is, because it is so annoying. Um, okay, I was going to go after this wolf, but, um, I still may do that. Yeah, Des, I think you can take it by yourself, right? Sure, why not? Emmy, you watch. Um, yeah, okay, Des did it. Boy, she got a little bit hurt, though. That might not have been the greatest idea. But, uh, let's see, did I tell you to melee attack it? Yes, I did. All right, Emmy, I don't think you're needed. So, yeah, go ahead and grab those components. And, uh, Des, you can go ahead and grab that wolf. All right, we have these eggs up here. Oh boy, they last two years. Say, so might move these down to the freezer, maybe? I don't know, do they count as like a meat source or something? I don't know. I don't know. I do know that we have a lot of food in here, though. And I would kind of like to get some of this other stuff out. And that's part of the reason is to expand the stockpiles out over here. We've got a full thing of bricks here now. Is anybody... Is anybody set to work on them? Yeah, they are, but I've got hauling bumped up, so people are going to do that first. So let's see. Yeah, we'll go ahead and take the hauling off. If it hasn't been hauled yet, um, we'll get it. Hopefully some of these. There we go. There's Sarah taking on the blocks. Des, how are you doing? Have you been treated? Yes, you have. You'll be fine. And a solar flare. That is not too bad. It's not too hot outside, or not too cold outside. So that is going to be just to stunt the plant growth a little bit. And I think we've got plenty. All right. So I think, oh, we got a fox. There's that stupid fox. I just need to learn, as soon as I see him, we need to kill him. As soon as I see him, we need to kill him because it, it they're always going to be a problem. They're never not going to be a problem. Never not going to be a problem. Uh, Sarah, why don't you go ahead and haul that since you are on your way over there. And um, yeah, I think I will go ahead and end this episode here. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.